eggy farts. That's what it is, eggy farts. Or vegetarian fart. Christmas fart. <laughs> I got my donut. So I've come back into the city, stopped off at Daily Donuts, and this here is the best seller. Normally I wouldn't get a, um, a plain one, but she said it's the best seller. Look, I would normally get one like that or something. But this one's nice. And she makes these every night here. She lives here. Um, cooks, no, in the morning, she said. She gets up really early and they normally sell out. By the time I got here yesterday, what time was that? Five, eating so much on this trip. Yeah, she's very pretty as well. <laughs> but she's married, she's got a kid. Okay, where the cow soy? You walk in and you see about specimen Yes, yeah, I know. Okay. Yeah, you so this is Fim. <laughs> this is her business. And I'm gonna put the business down below. So if you're ever in Fang, check out the what's it called again? Daily donuts. Yeah. See bat, just 10 bat for a tasty donut. Yeah. A Roy. And you get to meet the amazing Fim. So if you buy 10, maybe there's a group of you or something, and you get one free. And you can even get a green tea here or a Thai tea or some snacks. And you're open 10.30 until 8 p.m. Yes. Right, so come to Fang, get a donut. <laughs> right, guys, we are at the Fang Hot Springs. I've decided to check it out after all. And yeah, I'm glad I did. It looks quite good already. So what are we? 30 minutes, 30 minutes from the, um, from Fang Town, 25 minutes. Looks like there's a lot of tourists here. Woo! We made it, just about, but I'll tell you about that in a minute. Right, so we're in the National Park the hot springs is in the national park i forgot what it's called i'll put it up on the screen um it's a nice park i got to the um got to the ticket office i was reading it 60 baht for ties then i thought ah it'll only be like 100 for francs or something 300 for franc and um yeah, I wasn't having that, not having that 300 just for a look at the hot springs. Um, I tried, I said, oh, I've got a Thai driving license. Make sure I've got everything a minute. He said, oh, only ID card. If you've got Thai ID card, you can come in 60. Yeah, so I kept aggling and yeah, I was about to leave. I'm not paying 300 baht for, for hot springs and it's quite late in the afternoon and I was about to go and he said, oh, 150, half price for you. Um, and yeah, he's pocketing that money probably. And I said, okay, it's worth 150 to come and have a look. Um, yeah, 150, I think, okay. People are split on um, the dual pricing, I know that. But yeah, 360, I just think that's a bit, that's a bit too much, man too much difference right so what's up here okay it's just like a viewpoint ah cool look how high it goes that's gonna be good man let's get over there it's roasting not here what are we actually doing here let's get over where the action is sometimes the driving license wax sometimes it doesn't um, I always try it. Fang hot spring. Gee, look at that! Oh, yes! 
you know what the smell is? Eggs. It always is, or springs. It's the um, it's the gas, isn't it? The gas. Wow. Yeah, I'm glad I come now. got kids in here, people having picnic. Caution, boiling hot spring and scalding mud under the ground surface. Please walk on the designated trail. Parents, please watch your children closely. Let's sizzling. Ah, boiled eggs. Eggy farts. That's what it is, eggy farts. Or vegetarian fart, Christmas fart. Oh, mate. We have fang springs. That's probably the best one I've seen. I'm trying to keep out the the wind of the spray because the GoPro's not waterproof with the um with the external one. Ah yes. Don't think I'm getting any closer. Yes, yeah, nice. I reckon there's a lot more things to do in here. I was telling the guy I only want to go hot spring. I said I ain't paying 300 just to go hot spring, buddy. Right, so we're just going to take a walk, see what's down here. I've just seen a guy go, um, slip over down here, so I'm taking it easy. It's slippery here, man. So I'm taking it easy. Mate, he went down right there. Right, you see what's down here. Yeah, enjoying it. It's worth it's worth 150, I think. Because you can go around the whole park as well. Oh, this is where you can like, you can get in there. You can go bathing. So you can get in there. I think right. No. Oh, we've got a sprinkler on, man. Let's have a walk down here then. Yeah, it stinks, doesn't it? Absolutely stinks. So this, you can stay here, right? You can stay here. Yeah, this would be cool. Oh no, showers. Shower room. I'll just show you, look. So yeah, you can go bathing here. I could have went bathing. Ah, you can get your own private your own private one. Oh, that'd be cool, wouldn't it? I thought it was like all outside together. You get your own private, private bathing room. Why didn't I bring me shorts, man? <laughs> I could still go in. I might go in after. If they give me a towel. Mineral bathing. Yeah, mineral bathing. I could do with that, man. That'll do your skin some good, won't it? <laughs> mineral bathing. I have to admit, I take me out off. I wasn't going to come here. I thought not really interested in um, hot springs. I'm never doing Chiang Mai or anything, but yeah, I'm glad I did. I mean, you could spend a you could spend a full day out here as well, going around the national park. Ah, oh, right. This is an outdoor one. Look, got some frangs up there bathing. Mineral sauna. Foot wash. Could have. 
foot wash area. Okay, this is where you clean off after, isn't it? Free foot baths. I think you do have to pay extra, you know. Let's have a walk up here. Yes, yeah, so you do have to pay. You have to pay extra for the, um, the sauna. A pier Thai massage. Hello, Swaddy Cap. <laughs> Thai massage. But I'm going for one of them tonight. Yeah, lots of stuff to do here. You could sit in it. Well, you can't sit in it all day. It said 30 minutes back there. Yeah, I'm tempted to um, have one of them soap saunas, whatever it was. Yeah, it's not too expensive. But when you pay to get in here, you expect maybe to have it in a price, even though I got in here cheap, but um, it's all good. But uh, I don't know. I don't mind if I don't, because one of these little private ones would be good, right? Thing is, I can't film in there. It said no, no camera in the um, public one, and there's people in there as well. So, yeah. I would really like free foot baths. Okay, so you can have all sorts of guys. You can have your foot down. You can sit in the public sauna. I'm thinking about doing it myself but you can't take the camera in there there's people sitting in there and I don't know I don't think I will but it would be nice but, um, it, it does do your skin good it really does but there's quite a few people going in water temperature 87 C be careful not to fall down 87 C Oh, it's humming. Cool. Cause you in hot mud. Oh yeah, that is stinking. So closing soon. <laughs> I've come in. That's why he wanted the money. He, he was willing to take anything. It's just closing. I'm just standing here, guys. You can feel it. It's roasting. Oh yeah, that is hot, man. Roasting hot. So we can have a look at the, um, the visitor centre, just to see what it says here, man. Feel the fresh air, cool weather all year round. Yeah, a little bit of history on a place. Changed the name September 23rd. Oh yeah, this is um, quite interesting, isn't it? Hot springs are formed by hot molten rock that flows beneath the Earth's crust through the rock channels up close to the Earth's crust, causing the rock layers in that area to rise when ground water flows through such hot rocks. The temperature of the water increases accordingly, causing enormous pressure to push itself through the junction of the rock layers up to the surface of the earth to form a hot spring. There you go. Right, so I ended up dipping my feet a little bit, um, just in the free pool there. I'm gonna come back out. It's getting late now, man. It's knocking on for five o'clock, so it closes at 6 p.m. here. So I'm probably gonna head back down in a minute, guys. Um, take it back slowly. There's some amazing views on the way here, so I'm gonna show you on the way back. It's a lovely little road, man, and yeah, we'll we'll have a little chat down there because it's such a beautiful spot. Two days here is enough. Um, yeah, I'm gonna do another vlog after this. Another couple. I'm going out tonight, and I've got a vlog planned for what I'm gonna talk about tonight. And yeah, back to Chiang Mai tomorrow or Chiang Dao. Ah, my feet got some crap off my feet which has done me good so 
I might go for a massage as well later. I've seen a couple of cheap massages in town, but I'm heading back to the city and we're gonna have a little look on the way back and show you the breathtaking views. Look at this. This is the road up to the hot springs and you got all these people working in the fields here, look. And the mountainage, man, it is incredible. You can see the smog. I would say Fang is close to Myanmar, so it does seem there's more smog in Fang than Chiang Mai at the minute. But it's just, it's the best scenery I've seen. So we're gonna take a ride down this road. It's a shame that um, the camera, the um, GoPro's not doing it justice. But we're gonna ride down a bit. Absolutely beautiful, massive house. And look at the, well, you ain't got much of a view with that wall there. But look at this, boy. Look at that mountain. can't see nothing of the mountains hardly anymore. That's pollution mate. That's what's coming. That's why I wanted to get it out of the way now. This is probably the last trip around the north. Oh, it's been amazing. It just don't feel real. There's people living down here with that backdrop. Well, not now, it's covered in smog. But the, the scenery backdrop, it don't look real. Well, you can't see it now, but tomorrow morning again. It just looks like somebody's painted it or something. It is that perfect of a picture the best mountains I've ever seen by far up around the north best scenery right guys back on the main road now just gonna put a camera away and we'll catch up with you back in the city 